It's late July, and man, it has been hot. We've been experiencing record-breaking triple-digit temperatures. It hasn't been fun. And we've tried going out and looking for horses, but they haven't been anywhere to be found. Then today, a huge rain and hail storm rolled into the canyon and parts beyond. The temperatures dropped dramatically. And when we spotted these horses up on the hillside, we could smell the rain in the air and the moisture. It reminded me of Oklahoma. Look at that beautiful sky. And Rose has the binoculars and she says, there's a baby up here and I'm looking for it now. When I'm flying, I'm just holding my cell phone attached to the, the remote. So that's, it's hard to see things sometimes. So at this point, I'm looking for that horse and Rose says, look between the, the, the pintos that are there and as soon as I looked there, that, that showed me, oh, there it is. So I'm going to prepare to fly to it. And, and I'm in no hurry to get down there. I just want to take my time and make sure that they're comfortable with the drone. And I'm sure they're loving the, the great temperatures out here right now. It's beautiful. Look at that. And this little guy, he's he's a little bit nippy. Watch him here. Oh, mama, mama, mama. Me, me. And from the command module, I can actually hear them uh, vocalizing. It's crazy. I wish I had a, a microphone, but it's funny to hear them vocalizing while I'm flying. It's a great experience. Something's up. Yeah. Look at him. And I can hear him. It's funny. Look at him and Mama. Look at that. This is what I love about flying. I just let the action happen. I don't try and force them to do anything. And I just let nature unfold. Look at that, mama and baby. He's a good looking little boy too. I bet he's been rumbling around out in the mud and stuff. Oh, and thank you to everybody for leaving great names in the comments. You guys are awesome. Give this guy a name. Look at him. And guess what? If you look up at the top, I didn't even realize there's a baby back there in the back. I didn't even know while I was flying, but there's a baby back there. this little guy I don't know I'm looking at his face and I don't know if he's injured or something look under his eye it's it, I'll get a little bit closer here in a second but uh, maybe it's just mud or something but it looks like it's scuffed or uh, scratched or something you'll see here in a second He's still a young guy. A 
He's a good looking boy too. Hopefully he'll grow up big and strong and, and be the, the boss hoss of the canyon. He's probably got about another six months to go to be out of a, a menu territory for the mountain lions out there. But he's growing, he's doing well, look at him. Look at all those beautiful horses pretty awesome. Yeah, I didn't even realize that back in the back there was an even smaller uh, foal. And yeah, it's hard to see when you're flying if uh, just that small screen. Uh, the sunset, look at that, they're all pretty. It's magic light. And there's even more horses way back there on the other side of that hill. I hope you enjoy the view as much as I enjoy bringing it to you. It's pretty awesome. Look at that. The mountainscapes in the background. And look who's tucked between those two pintos there. This is a huge family of horses. Look at the one, the, the pinto on the bottom right, has a heart on her side. She's been in a lot of videos that I've done, a lot of flights over th three years now. So she's a, actually a lead horse. She's been in the lead of a lot of bands. Uh, uh, you'll see if you uh, look at the playlist, you'll see where she's in there on more than one occasion. A pretty horse. And they all follow her. And then that, that one right there is just glowing in the sunlight. Look at that one there. We really pass it. Let's go back around. Let's look for that baby. There he is. There's that guy. Look at their colors, their markings. It's a sight to behold, huh? Now, I don't know if you noticed or not, but there were actually three babies up there. Yeah, you're gonna have to rewind back to be able to see all three. It's amazing how peaceful these horses are. They just all hang out together and just be good horses. Thanks again for joining us on our adventures in the Wild Horse Canyon. Please like, subscribe, and share with all of your horse-loving friends. Oh, and by the way, we've had a couple of viewers that have asked, how far are you away when you're flying? And I. It, it just depends. Sometimes we're up to a half a mile away and sometimes we're really close. If you look down there, there's the command module right there. Yep. So we're just gonna go ahead and show you how this thing flies and docks with the command module.
Tranquility Base.